Welcome back to Campus Gulls. I'm Brianna Marr. And I'm Maya Drard. Let's find out what's happening this week at Endicott. On Wednesday at 5 p.m., the Intercultural Club is holding a members meeting in Library 122. Please note that attendance will not earn credit for study abroad applicants. Then, starting at 5.30 p.m., it's time to flock the nest as the women's and men's basketball teams compete in a doubleheader against Nichols in the McDonald Gymnasium. On Thursday, stop by Lower Callahan at 2 p.m. and relieve some start of the semester stress with cocoa, cookies, and coloring. Later at 8 p.m., Late Night Loca presents Stranger Thursdays featuring a Stranger Things viewing party with waffles. Then at 9 p.m., it's 21 plus night in gullies. On Friday, start the year off right by taking advantage of some opportunities to help others in the community. Check your Blue Buzz email for a variety of events that take place every Friday and could use some volunteers. And speaking of getting involved, the Winter Community Involvement Fair is happening in Lower Callahan from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Come meet representatives from many of the clubs and organizations on campus. Friday night is all about fun movies, and you get two to choose from. In Gullies at 8 p.m., it's the semester's first Christian community movie night. Also at 8 p.m., Late Night Loca presents Fired Up Friday with a screening of the cult classic as well as quesadillas and all the fixings. North Shore Shelter Fest is taking place on Saturday from noon to 9 p.m. in downtown Beverly at First Baptist Church. The All Day Music Festival will benefit Harbor Light Community Partners, North Shore's largest affordable housing provider and advocate. General admission of $10 gets you full day access and all the money goes to the cause. Food and support is provided by A&B Burger from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. Local music talent and Endicott student Sarah Schuyler will be performing. After enjoying a day of local music, stop by Late Night Loca at 8 p.m. and enjoy Sleepy Saturday where you can decorate pillowcases and eat cotton candy. Then on Sunday, head back to Lower Callahan for relaxation yoga at noon. Later, Cab presents a Grammys viewing party in Lower Callahan at 7 p.m. On Monday at 8 p.m., the Student Government Association will be holding its Senate meeting in the LSB Auditorium. Also at 8 p.m., the Christian Community Meeting takes place in the chapel. On Tuesday, learn more about the Alternative Spring Breaks Family Promise Program scheduled for March on the Endicott campus. Curious about getting involved? Attend an informational meeting in the Lower Callahan stage room at 12.30 p.m. or 4.45 p.m. Later, it's the weekly trivia night at Gully's starting at 8 p.m. Get your ticket now for the Frog Pond skating trip on Saturday, February 3rd at 2 p.m. Enjoy ice skating at the famous Frog Pond on Boston Common and have some time to enjoy dinner in the city. Your $15 ticket includes transportation, skating ticket, and ice skate rentals. Purchase your ticket through Blue Buzz. As the new semester begins, please remember that all types of plastic bags are no longer accepted in the blue recycling dumpsters. Waste management is requiring that all material be loose and dumped directly into the, into the dumpster. Please help Endicott reduce contamination by keeping things like plastic bags and food scraps out of the recycling. Your cooperation is crucial to making this transformation as easy as possible. Now let's take it to sports with Matt. Hello and welcome to this week's edition of EC Sports. For EC TV, I'm Matt Pritchard. Starting off on the ice, the men's ice hockey team currently ranked 4th and 6th in respective polls remain one of the top teams in the country. At 15-2-2, they will look to continue their solid year on the ice as they host number 10 and 11, Salve Regina, before traveling down to Salve on Saturday to complete the home-and-home -home series. On the women's side of things, they have been just as impressive as they sit at 14-2-1 and, and have been bouncing around the national polls. They'll look to improve on their record as they have their own home and home series with Becker on Friday and Saturday, starting out at the Raymond J. Bork Arena. Now on to the court. The men's basketball team is also having a successful season so far as they sit at 12-5 overall. They'll look to take it to conference opponent Nichols tonight before hitting the road for a Saturday battle with the Curry Colonels. The women's side is sitting just below 500 at 8 and 9 and are going to follow the men's schedule as they host Nichols tonight before hitting the road to Curry on Saturday as well. While winter sports are still going on, spring sports are slowly beginning. The men's volleyball team is 3-0 overall and 9-0 when it comes to sets. They look to stay red hot as they travel to Johnson & Wales this weekend to face off in three games over Friday and Saturday. 
And that'll do it for this week in EC Sports. For ECTV, I'm Matt Pritchard. Go out and support your basketball teams tonight. That's all we have for you this week, girls. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.